what we're going to do, we're going to enter in patient information in Bree's suite. We're going to sync it with the FOT. We're going to perform a test, and then we're going to sync it back into Bree's suite. We're going to go through that process. Okay, what we do is we enter in our patient information like we usually do in Bree's suite. I'm going to click Add Visit. I'm going to add in her height and her weight, but now I'm going to go down here and I'm going to hit FOT request. It's going to calculate my predicteds. And then once that's complete, it's going to pop up my FOT testing parameters. Number one, our default is three minutes. The next is the frequency or the stimulation. For a normal adult, you would select 5, 11, and 19 hertz. If my patient appeared to be obstructed, then I would use select 5 hertz. If my patient was a pediatric, then I would select 8. I'm going to go ahead and leave it at 5, 11, and 19. And I'm going to hit Submit. And it's going to say, once this happens, it's going to close my visit. I click OK. And Breeze is now transmitting or syncing to our FOT device. Notice that it closed my visit. I go over here to the FOT. So now what we do is we hit sync and it'll sync the data from Bree Suite. And there's Bree. I'm going to go ahead and select her. I'm going to hit pre. I'm going to measure my filter. It counts down from 10. I'm going to go ahead and instruct my patient. Okay, Bree, go ahead and put your mouth on the mouthpiece. Nose clips on. Head tilted slightly back. Hands on her cheeks. Perfect. I'm going to go ahead and start the test. And notice how it counts down from three, two, one. And then now we'll count up. We're going to stop Bree at 10 breaths. A nice feature of the Resmin Pro is go ahead and cough for me, Bree. <coughs> And notice that the breath count stops during that cough. And then we'll resume when we have, a, again, a good normal tidal breath. Now it has begun to count up. I'm going to stop breathing at 10, 7, 8. And notice we have real-time reactants and resistance. I'm going to stop her. That's it. Go ahead and come off the mouthpiece. Shows my two graphs. Hit next. I'm going to save my data. And saving the data and also syncing the data back into Bree's suite. Operation is complete. I go ahead and end my test. Now I'll go over back to the Bree suite software and show you the numerical and graphical data. So now what we do, we can either double click on Bree's visit or highlight it and hit open. Highlight this visit. Go to the FOT tab. Double click on the time. Here's my numerical data. And here's the resistance and reactance graphs and the change in reactance for inspiratory and expiratory on the right. And that's it. Go overhead, quick print. And then we can select what report that we would like to print. And that's it.